It sounds like you're describing a business venture, possibly involving banking or financial services, and focusing on Michigan's growing Arab population. You're also likely referring to a complex network of currency centers and financial institutions of 93 in total. Let's break it down into a fuller exploration of this dynamic, while considering both the economic landscape and the importance of Michigan's Arab community. Michigan, particularly the Detroit metropolitan area, has one of the largest Arab populations in the United States. Detroit's Dearborn, a city adjacent to Detroit, is home to one of the most significant Arab communities in North America, with a large number of Arab immigrants coming from countries like Lebanon, Iraq, Yemen, and Palestine. Over the decades, this population has grown significantly, contributing not only to the cultural diversity of the region but also to its economic vitality. The presence of this community has fostered various entrepreneurial activities with numerous businesses catering to the needs of both the local Arab population and the broader Michigan market. This includes restaurants, grocery stores, real estate agencies, automotive businesses, and importantly a banks and financial services that specialize in serving the needs of Arab Americans. The reference to the CBI Bank seems to point to a financial institution that plays a central role in the Arab community's economic infrastructure. In a multicultural area like Michigan, banks that understand the specific needs of immigrant populations can thrive. This includes offering services that are aligned with cultural norms, such as providing financing options that comply with Islamic law, Sharia compliant banking which prohibits charging interest on loans. It seems like you're referring to a network of financial institutions providing currency exchange, international remittance services, and other financial products that cater specifically to the Arab American community. These services are crucial, given that many members of the community frequently send money back home to their countries of origin or engage in cross-border business transactions. Currency centers also cater to the specific needs of businesses in Michigan that import and export goods, especially those between the United States and the Arab world. Additionally, with Michigan's diverse population, currency exchange centers also serve customers who may require services in multiple languages, further increasing their accessibility and appeal. Michigan holds strategic importance not just because of its large Arab population but also due to its status as a manufacturing hub, especially in the automotive industry. The state's role as a major economic engineer home to companies like General Motors, Ford, and Chrysler also makes it a natural hub for financial institutions that can support the needs of international trade, investments, and remittances. On Michigan's economy is felt across various sectors, including real estate, retail, and services but also more deeply in the financial sector. With a growing number of immigrants, especially from countries like Iraq, Syria, and Lebanon, the demand for tailored financial services such as remittance services, Islamic banking products, and loans to small businesses has driven the expansion of banks and currency centers in the region. In cities like Dearborn, the Arab population has grown so significantly that the area has taken on a distinctly Arab American character. Here, you'll find Arabic spoken in public spaces, Arab owned businesses, and a cultural atmosphere that closely mirrors the communities back home. These Arab enclaves also create a specific demand for products and services that cater to their cultural and religious practices. It's not just about financial services but creating a sense of belonging and support for a group of people who may be far from their homelands. Establishing businesses and banks that understand these cultural intricacies, whether that's providing whole investment options or offering language services, can make a significant difference in building trust and loyalty among customers. The future of banking in Michigan, particularly for the Arab American community, looks poised for further growth. As the population continues to grow, so too does the demand for specialized services. The role of financial institutions like CBI Bank, 
with their network of currency centers and understanding of the unique needs of the Arab community, could become even more vital in ensuring that the financial ecosystem continues to serve these populations effectively. Additionally, given the strong entrepreneurial spirit among Michigan's Arab community, businesses and financial institutions that foster both growth and integration into the broader American economic framework will likely continue to thrive. Expanding into more cities and towns across Michigan, and even beyond the state, may be a natural next step for a network of currency centers poised to grow with the community they serve.